Hey guys, it's Kevin over here at Lakeside Buggies and I'm in our Addison store. I've got something really cool to show you, but it's not this fully custom I-40L. It's gonna be the new Icon e-bikes. These things are awesome. <laughs> I've ridden one around for just a little bit. I haven't put a lot of miles on it. I did put about 10 or so miles on this thing. It zips around 25 miles an hour really quickly. I weigh about 280 pounds and it held me just fine. And we were cruising down the street they come in 13 different colors, so they've got one to match every Icon golf cart. I think this one right here might be one of my favorites. They're not just pedal assisted, they are electric. So you can jump on this, hit the throttle, and you're gonna go. And I mean, you're gonna fly. Reservoir shocks on both sides, disc brakes on the front and the rear in true Icon style. Digital screen. Super bright LED headlight. You hold down this plus button here, that'll turn on that bright LED headlight. And we've got a lot of lights in here. Super bright, also adjustable. So you, uh, you have a couple little screws down there at the bottom. You can loosen those, move this around, get that in a better spot for you so you can see great at night. Super simple controls. Let me hop on this thing here. <laughs> this is so cool. So super simple controls. Right now you're in the number one assist mode. You go to number two, you get a little bit faster on there. Number three, four, five, and so on. Your battery meter is here. These are lithium powered. Uh, your mileage gauge is here. Odometer is here. And then you also have gears to shift through, just like a typical bike. This is your throttle. <laughs> and then you've got your uh, front brake over here, your rear brake over here, and you got an awesome little bell. So now comes the question how I'm gonna ride this and get you guys a video with one hand, and I guess we're just gonna kind of do it. So here we go. So this is not easy with one hand, but like I said, this is a, a pedal assist. So you can pedal this like a normal bike or you can hit this throttle pedal here, or this throttle on the handle here. This thing is awesome. But it looks like the controller's kind of set to lock in at 20 right there. So I don't know if I had changed a couple of settings on the other one, it's possible. But look at this guys, I mean, how smooth is that? I've got one hand on the wheel. Total daredevil mode here. This is awesome. All right, so you got a little kickstand back here on the back kicks down super super easy it's not like a harley where you've got to fight the thing these bikes are actually pretty lightweight i mean i could definitely pick this up and put it in the back of a pickup truck or a back of an suv if you had a little golf um hitch on the back of your golf cart you could definitely put this on the back of a golf cart with a bike rack uh, holder you got a little water bottle holder they do have a serial number here on the front for your warranty purposes Little storage rack there on the back and they also come with a helmet and they'll come with a um a little bag of tools like an entire toolkit so you when you get these out of the box there's a little bit of assembly it takes about 15 minutes of assembly everything that you need is in the box you don't need to get a single tool out of your toolbox here's your rear peg for your passengers All right, a little bit of technical difficulty there. My one-handed riding here, I guess I uh, stopped the recording. So I'm picking it back up where I just left off. What I was saying about this thing, I could see uh, I could see two up on this if you're two smaller frame people. I don't think myself at 280 pounds could have one of my buddies riding on the back with me. But uh, yeah, let's go take this thing for another ride. All right, so let's see here. Okay, so the best I can tell here, 
uh, if you downshift your gears here, the only thing you're really going to feel a difference on is the pedal down the bottom. The actual speed doesn't seem to really change, but uh, I'm pedal assisting right now instead of uh, using the throttle there. Pedal assisting where I'm kind of like riding a bike with no hands. So as soon as I start to push the pedal, we're moving. As soon as you start touching that pedal, you're, you're going just like as if you're hitting the throttle here. So right now, I need a little bit more resistance on this. See, now I'm not touching the throttle at all, but I need, I need more resistance. I don't have enough feel here to ride no hands. So I go up to seven here. She's still just hauling it. Ah. That's just a new feeling for me. I haven't, <laughs> I haven't done that. I've ridden motorcycles standing up in the seat on the highway, but I've never ridden one of these electric bikes with no hands. And it's kind of just like riding a bike, except when you get tired, you hit the pedal. Now, another thing about these is you can ride it just like a normal bicycle. So you can shut it all the way off, you're off. Battery's dead, say for example. No big deal, you're still gonna get home. And it doesn't feel like it's any more difficult to pedal than a normal bike would be. Now the gears are going to do as they should. So we're going to go a lot slower while I'm pedaling at this speed. Uphill grade. Let me turn it back on. I'm too tired for this. All right, we're back on. And if you're like me and you're out of shape and you want to get some exercise, maybe this is a good way to get started. You can ride until you're just too tired to make it home. And then you turn the bike on and you pedal away. I, I know me, I'd never turn this thing off. <laughs> this is too cool. I guess if you're in like an RV park, you've got some large off-road tires that you can get over uh, obstacles pretty easily with. where we take a lot of the pictures for our website. So uh, after COVID, we're, we're in Addison, Texas here, and after COVID, a lot of these office buildings are basically abandoned. It's, it's crazy. <laughs> that was a lot of fun. <laughs> I, I, I'm the kind of guy who loves toys. I think if you watch some of my other videos, you kind of get that about me by now. Love toys, love having a good time. I love things that don't cost a lot of money to have a good time. So that brings me to the last thing on these. They're $25.99. You can finance them with your golf cart. So if you come in and buy a lime green I-40L, you wanna get it all customized and tricked out. If we can get your approval up high enough so it can cover all of your accessories and one of these e-bikes, you can walk out the door right now with Icon at a 0% rate, all of your accessories included and no money down. With approved credit, the right debt to income on there, you can finance $20,000 real easily. That'll get you the bike, the lithium battery and the golf cart, the custom seats, custom wheels, color matched to boot. Guys, these things are incredible. Um, we may uh, ship these, but I don't, I don't know that that's actually gonna be a thing. You may have to just come in and purchase these in-house. I feel like if we ship these, they're gonna wind up getting damaged unless we spend four or $500 on freight. <clears throat> if you really want one of these and your local dealer does not have one and you need us to ship it to you uh, Give us a call talk to Carlos. We'll see what we can do on it um, I don't want to turn anybody away from having a good time. Just understand that you're gonna have to pay for the freight. Oh my gosh <laughs> I can't wait to put my phone away and get both hands on the wheel of this thing and go for another ride All right guys, well that's it for me Thanks for watching my videos. I've really been picking up a lot of subscribers and really appreciate that, guys. Uh, these, these videos are short and they're all fun for me, but uh, 
you know, I, I like to give as much information as I possibly can, even if I don't know everything. Uh, and if you guys have any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comments. I'm very active on there. I answer as quickly as I possibly can and uh, I'd be happy to answer anything you'd like on these. And if you guys want to see another video on one of these bikes, let me know what you'd like to see. I'm absolutely happy to do it. All right, guys, I'm off.